So guys, welcome back to the journey for uh, Chuck Norris or Chuck Norris saga here. I don't even know what to call this series, but it's just so fun playing this series. I've been playing. I've been recording like four or five episodes today. This is so fun. We are ten games into the season. We have twenty points, and uh, we have a few games playing in this game as well. But I do not really know if I want to play this one against Toronto. But I. I don't really have a choice, so I can't, I can't just skip it. But my average rating for this game is, or for this, uh, or for this season actually, they want me to have uh, keep an average league match rating of 6.7. I have an 8.10. They want me to keep 14 clean sheets. We have they we are projected at 27 if we keep this up. I want you to have an average uh, less than 0 0.7 0 .7 fouls per match. That's something that we're not going to do. Uh, hold an average tackle success rate of 59%. We have 56. So I think we could do that. But I don't know. We are playing pretty decent. So let's jump into this game against uh, Toronto FC. And uh, see if we can actually actually win this game as well. Ooh, that was a bad tackle right away. We might actually go out right away here. Yep, <laughs> we have played. We have played enough. We played two minutes and thirty seconds into this game. We get a, our first red card. Forty-five red cards to go, I guess. Uh, that was not my intention. We got a three-point-eight in that. Uh, our strength gone up by one because we ended the match with uh, more than fifty percent. Uh, of our stamina left, but shit, that was not good. Racking up the red cards. I like this short, so it's clear. You have to show more discipline on the pitch. Getting suspended is not something we take lightly at this club. See you at training, assistant manager. They are not happy about that tackle at all, and I'm not happy about that tackle at all either, because that was not good. The only good thing is that we can work on some more training here. We're gonna go into. Uh, going to medium training there. We're gonna go dribbling course. We're gonna go hard on that one. Through balls. We're gonna go hard on that one as well. And the passing. Let's go hard on that one as well. Chance creation or shooting. Let's go. Uh, what should we do here? Uh, let's go hard on sharp shooting and see what we get. I. Oh, I did not want to get. I. I thought I was actually gonna get away with that tackle but I didn't get away with it and I got a red card we luckily for us we drew that game so it didn't really matter that much but still could have been better uh, I'm not been selected into this squad because I had a red card so we're gonna have to simulate this game and see what's gonna happen we are playing as uh, Seattle no uh, I can't remember the name, but we drew anyway. Asprilla with uh, or Asprilla with a goal for Timbers and uh, Coleman with another goal for FC Dallas. He's he's racking up goals now and again. Actually, he's been playing really well. And uh, I'm ready for action again. Quick heads up: your suspension has expired, which means you are eligible to play again. But the reason uh, or the thing is, do they really want to play me again? That's the thing. Do they want to play me? It looks like it. Um, I only, I only succeeded with one of uh, my manager's uh, uh, goals here that they put up on from me. Uh, they want me to keep your tackle success rate above 80. I got 42. Get a clean sheet. We did that. Uh, get an average rating on nine. We got an average rating on 7.10 or 7.1, which is not good. So I don't think that's gonna affect my starting 11. My starting position right now. I don't know. And uh, now they want me to get an average rating on nine again. Like why an average rating on nine every every single day, uh, every single time? Uh, at least one clean sheet and uh, less than three fouls per match. That I can't keep down. I think. But yeah, I have been picked in this one. But I'm gonna take a look at my uh, at uh, Chuck Norris traits here. Oh, have I unlocked anyone? Please. No, I haven't unlocked a single one. 
we are actually going to do some stuff here. I want uh, the ankle tape. I want it in. Uh, I want it in black. No, white is better. I want it to be. I want the shirt to be tucked in actually, and I want short sleeves. I can't have gloves or anything else. So that's how he's gonna look like for this uh, game, I guess, and for the for the future. Uh, we are playing against uh, Seattle Sounders now. We are on second place, 12 games in, 22 points. Seattle Sounders are on nine games, 17 points. Let's just go. Let's just jump into this game against Seattle Sounders. I'm gonna count the first one as a game, uh, so we have played two games into this episode, so let's just go and see what's gonna happen. Chuck Norris! No! Oh, we missed that. Chucky, that was so close. You get a yellow card now as well. But that was so close, that should have been a goal. You actually want a header as well. Oh. Ah, uh, there goes the final whistle. It's another poor game by us. And. It's another poor game by the entire team. We had chances to actually score a goal, but we didn't do it. We completed 92% of our passes. We won 66% of our tackles. And shots wasn't that good, though. 33%. But we get a 7.1. We get another clean sheet. And we get another point. But... Uh, I don't know. I could have been tougher if I didn't have a yellow card. Alright, now we're going to play a game against New England. New England are... I don't know where they are in the team. They should be in the Western... Uh, or in the East Conference. They are... In the East Conference, they are on 6th place. 12 games in, 14 points. We have, after 13 games played, 23 points. Really decent stuff, but... Ah, I don't know. Like... We, we can do better. A way, an away game against New England. We should be play, playing better than this. Hopefully we can grow up to 72 after this uh, episode. That would be really nice. Oh! <laughs> what a goal! What the hell was that? What a goal! I wasn't even going to comment that. Because I was so mad that why the hell did he take a shot from that? But that is a world class, world -class strike. Holy shit, Roland Lamar, I think it's like 59 Raider or something, but what the fuck was that? That was such a nice strike. Oh, Chuck Norris sets that up. Oh, yes, 2-0, beautiful stuff, and we created that as well. Beautiful stuff, that's top football by the FC Dallas. And that's 2-0 away from home against New England. And it looks like we're going to get three new points. Look at this. That's beautiful. Over to the other side. And he bangs it from the side that the keeper throws him. He throws to the right. Uh, Akindele shoots to the left. Like, that's just so nice. Beautiful shot. And that's 2-0. I don't know if I should be asked to be subbed off right now. Because, like... Sure, my fitness is pretty decent, but at the same time, it's the game looks pretty over. It's 2-0 up. I, I'm, I don't think they need their strongest uh, uh, defender right now. Chuck Norris on side. Is he going to score? Yes, he is. Chuck Norris with another goal. That's 3-0. 9.2 in rating. Chuck Norris gets his second goal for this season. Look at this. Barely on side, but that's a beautiful finish. Keeper gets his hand to it, but he can't keep the ball down. And that's his second goal for this season. Chuck Norris, the right back. Two goals in the MLS. Goal in the United minute. 3-0 FC Dallas against uh, New England. This is just getting better and better. And there goes the final whistle. Chuck Norris gets the man of the match, probably. Because he has a 9.2, so I, I don't know. Maybe he gets the man of the match. I don't, I'm not sure. But... He completed 50% of his shooting, 94% passing, 75% tackling. He won 6 tackles out of 8. That's really solid. And he scored a goal. Chuck Norris, the man of the match, probably. Is he? I want to see. Yeah, Chuck Norris, man of the match. Guy got a 9.2. No one was even close to him. Or Alright, Lamar, Lamar was close to him with a 9.1. But we did really, really good. Alright, a game coming up right now against the uh, San Jose Quakers, uh, or Quakes, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, we are on Saturday, May 28, 2016. We have 
completed 14 games in the league, 26 points, and uh, we just got uh, we got we just got home from just yet another victory, a huge victory away from home with a three nil or a three nil victory, and Chuck Norris scored a three nil goal as well, and uh, he got a 9.2 in that game. Should be growing up to 72 into this episode, but let's just jump into this game first against uh, San Jose and see what's going to happen. Hopefully Chuck Norris can keep up his good form and score another goal. That would be great. Chuck Norris, keep going. Chuck Norris, keep going. Keep going. Send your player now. Oh, yes! Another assist by Chuck Norris. 8.1. He squeezes through two players. Sets up... Uh, I don't even know who that is. But he sets him up anyway, and that's a beautiful finish. That's 1-0 FC Dallas against San Jose, and Chuck Norris is on fire right now. It's Uruti again. Look at this. Gets past two players there, gets the pass away, and boom, what a finish. Keeper can't react in time, and that's 1-0 FC Dallas. His second goal in the MLS for the season, Uruti with a goal. That's, uh, I think that's uh, his... Second or third assist into the season from uh, Chuck Norris. He's just doing better and better for every game. So now he has one goal and one assist in um, below one goal or one one and a half game. Here he is again, Chuck Norris. That in. Chuck Norris is there. Yes, he gets another goal. Chuck Norris makes it 2 0. What a beauty of a cross as well. Chuck Norris is there to punch his thir third goal for this season. His second goal in two games. He has one goal and one assist in this game. Chuck Norris is on a rampage. Three goals in MLS. 89th minute. Yet again a late goal by Chuck Norris. But he is on the right spot there. And he squeezes that ball in. Beautiful goal. We are now on, on 9.3. And there goes the final whistle, we get a win, three new points, Chuck Norris with a goal and an assist. 75% of the shooting hit the target, decent one, uh, 89 passing, or 89% passing, 50% in tackling. Really solid stuff by the right back, Chuck Norris. 9.3, two or one goal and one assist, two goals and one assist in the last two games, that's just amazing by him. Alright guys, we're going to play our last game of this episode, uh, and a game against uh, Houston Dynamo, and uh, Houston Dynamo are, I don't really know where they are in the table, I don't even think, oh they are really far down, they are uh, on ninth place in our uh, conference, in the Western Conference, with only 10 points, which means that they are also bottom last almost. They're, they're almost, they're like sharing the the second to last place if you take like every single team. They are like on a 19th, 18th place. So that should be an easy win. FC Dallas against uh, Dynami Houston, or Houston Dynamo. And we are in the starting 11 again. We have also grown up to be 72 rated right now. We are gone up by 6 this season. And uh, our value are on 4.3 million. Short passing has gone up by 10 to 70. Slide tackling has gone up by 7 or gone up by 7 to 74. Stand tackle gone up by 10 to 76. Stamina gone up by 3 to 76. Marking gone up to by 5 to 68. Our marking could be better though. But we are doing pretty decent, and we have scored three goals in the league so far as well. Uh, let's jump into this last game of this episode. Let's see if Chuck Norris can keep his form up, scoring maybe another goal or set up another goal as well. That would be nice. Chuck Norris sets that up. Can he get the ball back? Yes, he can. Chuck Norris with the ball. Can he pass that in? Yes, he can. Can he bang that one? Yeah, but it didn't really go to anything. But we get a corner at least. All right, I'm going to go up here because we have a player that can actually defend that if something needs to be done. Pass me. Oh, yes, no, no, <laughs> so close. Win the header, laid off to Chuck Norris. He's just gonna go. Chucky, go. Go Chuck. Go, take a shot. Oh, hits the crossbar. 
And that goes in, and that's a goal. Coleman with the goal, I think it is. Yes, it is. Prinsby gone up. That's decent. Under Armour shirt we got as well. That's one. That's nice. But I don't know. Are we going to get an assist for that? I don't know. Christian Coleman with four goals in MLS right now. It's it's Shark Norris and uh, Christian Coleman who actually carry th carries this team. We are playing so well together. Like Coleman with four goals. I've set him up on like pretty much every goal. And uh, Chuck Norris has just been a beast scoring three goals from his right back position. So we are just playing better and better together as a team right now. Chuck Norris gets the ball. Is he going to finish that? Yes, he is. That's his third goal in three games from the right back. Chuck Norris. 2-0 FC Dallas. Look at that beautiful pass and a finesse shot past the keeper. Holy shit, is Chuck Norris going to win the top goal scorer from a right back position? That's four goals in MLS by Chuck Norris. He now has three goals and one assist in in three games. Chuck Norris is carrying this team on his shoulder. You just give him the captain that's been. Like he is the captain for this team. Oh, go. Go, Chuck Norris. Go. Go. Go, Chuck. Just go. Go score. Yes, Chuck Norris with his second goal of the game. That was why I didn't really I didn't really care about defending that. That's why I just backed off a bit. Because I knew that we were gonna win that and they were gonna pass me. So Chuck Norris gets his second goal of this game. Five goals in the MLS. Chuck Norris the right back. And 3-0 FC Dallas against Houston. He was so tired there. I went full. Po I went full power on, on, uh, on the thing is there. But he he just didn't have any strength left to make a heavy touch and actually go somewhere. But it worked up. It paid off. We get a goal. Three nil in total. Two goals by Chuck Norris. Five games or five goals in in this season so far 92% passing completed 50% 50% of the shot completed as well and uh, didn't really win a single tackle which is really bad for a defender actually but we did decent I'm really happy about that 3-0 Chuck Norris with two goals that is great and I want to see the stats for this game as well 14 shots 8 on target by FC Dallas 4 shots 1 on target by Houston and we get 3 points Chuck Norris what an episode this has been. Alright, this is how the ma manager notes looks like. We almost completed an average 9. We get an 8.6 and we kept a clean sheet. We kept uh, uh, less than 3 fouls per game as well. So we completed again 2 out of 3. Decent stuff. And we are now going to complete the final uh, training session for this game. We are just growing in stats everywhere and we are almost up to 73 as well. We are halfway to 73 rating. Like Chuck Norris has been so fun to play with and I think we unlocked a new... No, no we didn't. We didn't unlock anything new. But uh, I think we actually uh, unlocked something here. Did we? Uh, I don't know, did we? No, I don't think we did. Oh yeah, we unlocked an undershirt. All right, that's nice. But we don't need that right now, so I don't even gonna care about that. But uh, I wanna, I'm, I'm gonna simulate. Oh, stop the simulation. We can do some more training. We, we're gonna do more training, and then we're gonna end the episode. I'm sorry. I, I didn't know that we, there was that much time left on the, on the thingy. Uh, but now we can skip through to the next the game that's gonna be oh here's the thing is for that uh, as well but I don't care about that right now uh, we're gonna play in the next episode again a game against Kansas City Sporting but yeah this is how the table looks like after 16 games played in the league we have 32 points uh, second place uh, in the league of course uh, behind Colorado Rapids who has uh, 32 points as well, but they have only played 15 games. As well of, as uh, Result Lake, they, only, they are 27 points in, but they only played 14 games. But I want to see this uh, player stats. I want to see top goal scorers, 7 goals by Mane. 
And Chuck Norris on seventh place with five goals and assists. I think we are here as well somewhere. Uh, maybe not. I can't see Chuck Norris anywhere here. Oh, there he is on 16th place with two assists. Oh, he only has two? I thought he had more than two assists. But yeah, it's uh, been a decent episode. We scored a lot of goals with Chuck Norris in this one. We are grown by 6 to 72 rating. Uh, I'm going to end this episode here. If you have enjoyed it, leave a like. And uh, if you're new to my channel as well, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys later with another episode of the Chuck Norris series.